After hitting the scoreboards at Giga Shanghai, Elon Musk and his company Tesla is now prepared to set up new titles at the Giga Texas. Tesla CEO Elon Musk upheld this news on Twitter last December when he was replying to a question from one of the users on the social media platform. The construction of the Giga Texas began a few years ago and is now in its ultimate stage. Musk has already started to prepare for the manufacturing at Giga Texas and is soon going to initiate it. Well, do you want to know more about it? Stay tuned in the video. Welcome to Tesla Exposed. And today we are going to talk about Tesla's new Giga Texas factory. So without any further ado, let's begin. Tesla is all set to unwrap its latest facility in the US, the Texas Gigafactory for production. The US-based EV maker has been readying this facility for some time now. Its CEO, Elon Musk, has now ascertained that the production facility will be enlisted during a grand opening party with factory tours, which is likely to take place in early 2022. Tesla Gigafactory Texas will have a grand opening party for when it finishes construction and completes everything on its list, says Elon Musk and it is going to take place in 2022. The building would be the subsequent site of Tesla vehicle production in the company's new headquarters, focusing on the many electric vehicles it will bring to the public for sale. It is only a matter of time before Tesla's new gigafactory in Austin, Texas, is officially cleared for production. And honestly, at this point, it doesn't make a difference if it opens in the next few hours or within a couple of days. However, it seems that this may be more realistic, at least based on a bunch of information brewing on social media. And yes, keep in mind that the Gigafactory Texas is Tesla's fifth global factory, at least as far as early planning is concerned. Though it appears it may open ahead of Giga Berlin, which was planned months before Giga Austin. Located in Travis County, the Texas Gigafactory will be completely powered by renewable energy. The current system has a footprint of more than 1.9 million square feet, which rooms approximately 5.3 million square feet of functional space across several floors. The initial model to be assembled at the new factory is the Tesla Model Y from early 2022, with initial Cybertruck production expected to start in late 2022 pursued by volume production from 2023. Giga Texas will also begin building the Tesla Semi sometime in 2023, according to Tesla's most recent assessment. By the end of July 2020, construction was started up. The Tesla Gigafactory obtained state tax incentives worth about $50 million through the Texas Tax Code Chapter 313 program. The first fully completed Tesla Model Y rolled off the line at Giga Texas in the last week of August 2021 under trial production. Elon Musk had earlier notified that the Texas Gigafactory will generate around 20,000 jobs. Giga Texas is a $10 billion investment over time, generating at least 20k direct and 100k indirect jobs, Musk has said. The facility is also going to have general assembly, paint, casting, stamping and body shop facilities. According to a report by Tesla RT, solar panels have been coming and they are already being inducted over the roof areas of the Model Y and Cybertruck production centers. However, it's not the fact that the panels are going up that's so telling, but rather a related tweet from Yi Chai Global. It is also important to note that the solar panels are being provided by Long Yi Green Energy. Tesla is receiving delivery of yet another giant casting machine, known as Gigapress at Gigafactory Texas as the automaker shifts to generate entire car bodies in just a few pieces. Tesla has already been producing the Model Y with a single rear body piece that replaced 70 different parts in the vehicle. Over the last few years, Tesla has been heavily investing in casting and alloy technology to stimulate larger casted parts that have the potential to greatly streamline manufacturing. The company has acquired several units of the biggest casting machines in the world. Those giant, multi-million dollar machines are developed by Idra. For those who don't know IDRA, it is the company that produces the colossal die-casting machines Tesla is using to cast its vehicles in large sections, which simplifies the production cycle and furnishes a number of notable benefits. Tesla's first Gigapress, which was installed at the Fremont factory, was put into operation in 2020. The machine, nicknamed Gigapress, was the first of its kind at the time and has a clamping force of 55,000 to 61,000 kilonewton. Now, Tesla has begun deploying those machines at other factories in the US, Berlin and China. And Gigafactory Texas in Austin has been getting a lot of them. According to Tesla Rati, these shipments indicate that Tesla could now have four 6,000-ton IDRA machines precisely for manufacturing the Model Y electric crossover. However, these die-casting machines could potentially be of a different size, such as the larger models that will be utilized for the Tesla Cybertruck. Though that's not as likely since Tesla will start up creating the Model Y long before the electric pickup truck. 
Earlier this month, reports from the Lone Star State occurred, noting Tesla is gathering the necessary documents to ensure that Gigafactory Texas could be opened smoothly. Travis County spokesperson Hector Nieto even noted that certain sections of Giga Texas have already collected their respective certificates of subordination from the county fire marshal. Such certificates are needed before a facility can be formally opened. Also, the Ved Bush Managing Director and Senior Equity Analyst Dan Ives recently posted a fairly interesting estimate for Tesla's Gigafactory Texas project. According to the Wall Street veteran, Giga Texas may very well be capable of starting Model Y production over the next 7 to 10 days. If Wedbush's estimate proves accurate, Tesla could see some serious propulsion this Q1 2022. One of the pitch models that Tesla will start manufacturing at this facility is the electric Cybertruck. Revealed back in 2019, the Cybertruck claims to return a range of nearly 950 kilometers on a single charge. Tesla claims the Cybertruck can accelerate from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in just 3 seconds and is capable of towing up to 6,300 kilos of weight. Once launched, the Cybertruck will take on rivals like the GMC Hummer EV, Ford F-150 Lightning, and Rivian R1T electric pickup trucks in the US markets. Last year, a snapshot of the first single front casting part of the Model Y produced at Gigafactory Texas leaked. In October, it was reported that Tesla produced the first Model Y with both front and back single-piece casting. While Tesla has tumbled behind in starting production at Gigafactory Texas, which was believed to kick off last year. It looks like the automaker is going to start production with its front and back single-piece casting with Gigapress and possibly link both with its structural battery pack. This will drastically lessen the number of parts required to develop a vehicle body, which will simplify production and greatly curtail the capital needed to deploy production capacity. The Gigafactory Texas, however, only took a short time to finalize its construction, something with which Tesla is popular as it is fruitful in its production. Currently, Tesla relies solely on the Fremont plant to fulfill the increasing demand from the US market, but the California facility can only build about 500,000 EVs per year. This has led to delivery timelines close to a year for some of the company's most popular vehicles. Also, there have been so many holdups in Germany, therefore Tesla has returned to yield Model Y crossovers in China at Giga Shanghai and shipping them to the area. One will think that the Germans would hope to move things forward so that its residents can buy German-made Teslas rather than those produced in China. Hopefully, Giga Austin will also open in the coming time. Till then, don't worry about anything. We will keep you posted on every little thing happening out there. And once the Austin factory is fully ramped up, it's foreseen to more than double Tesla's output in the United States. Well, this is it for the day, guys. What do you think about this new Giga factory in Austin, Texas? When do you think it will begin? Next week, next month, or perhaps next year? Let us know in the comments below. And most importantly, if you want to be updated on every single topic related to Elon Musk, then you should consider subscribing to the channel and pressing the bell icon. See you in the next one. Until then, peace.